New at five, the Tennessee Secondary Schools Athletic Association says they're dealing with a referee shortage. This is something many athletic associations all across the country are battling. WSMV's Marissa Sulik talked with the association today to see how they plan to combat this. Hey there, Marissa. Hey, Marius. Yeah, their solution is Thursday night games. And one of the first ones of the season will be held here at Pearl Cone High School this Thursday when the Firebirds take on the Hillwood Hilltoppers. At a local high school football game, any touchdown wouldn't officially count if the man in the black and white striped shirt wasn't there. Actually, we're really lucky because I've got 195 registered officials. Junior Ward schedules and assigns the TSSAA games for Middle Tennessee, one of the few areas he says recruiting isn't a problem. All these people moving into Nashville, we have a lot of officials also moving into Nashville. This year alone, he says 15 referees in the Middle Tennessee region transferred from other states. But that's not the case everywhere. But when you get out to the rural areas, you just don't have that number of people. TSSAA says before COVID, they had 1,500 refs in Tennessee. Now that number is closer to 1,300. The rural areas struggle ward accommodates with his Nashville staff. When they come up short and need a crew for a game, I'll assign a crew to their game. And we do that. Uh, four or five times a year. To alleviate the problem more, they scheduled a few Thursday night games. If I had 25 games on Friday night, which I could have, then we couldn't service. Which is why fans and players must make way for Thursday night lights. Now there's only going to be about five or six Thursday night games this year, and so far they say they have not had to cancel any games, which is good news. Marius. I love Friday night lights, but you got to do what you got to do. Marissa Sulik, thank you.